what advice would you give to these guys that instantly are becoming millionaires? Uh, I will say um, you are instantly in debt right now. Uh, a lot of these guys, you got to understand, you got to pay your agent. You got to pay the guys that you did pre-draft training with, you know, the people that put you up in some place in a new city. Um, you're going to get to your new city and you're going to have to get a place. You're going to want to get a car. A lot of these guys are going to want to do something for their families, their mom and their dads. Um, and they haven't got a check yet. You know, a lot of these guys even took out some uh, lines of credit already. So they're already starting off in debt. And then when you think about it, uh, you're going to get taxed half. So what everybody thinks you make is definitely not what you're actually going to make. This first year is going to be really tough. But I, I will say, you know, guys, get experts in your corner, get people that you trust. You want a fiduciary financial advisor. You know, you want a CPA that's going to be there helping you with budgeting and help you understand that you're going to be taxed in every state that you play in. You know, I think about having a lawyer and having a lawyer work for you on hours so he can look over these contracts for you. Um, the work that we do at Educor, you know, is helping a lot of athletes and entertainers who are in a unique situation. They're going to come into a lot of money, young, early, with a small window of time to take advantage of it. So you want people in place to help you grow um, and or uh, help that money last for as long as you can, because it is early when a lot of this money is coming in. Would you be open to helping any of these kids if they you know, came to you, Greg, you've been there before and I know you're helping people with this now. It seems like you'd be open to lending a, lending a voice to them. I'm definitely open to all of these guys. You know, if anybody wanted my help, I'm definitely here. That's what I want to do. You know, I wasn't able to do it on the court, but you know, right now, all the knowledge, all my experiences that I've been through, I'm definitely here to help out a lot of these guys. And that's what I want to do in life. Was there something you did uh, with, your, with that first paycheck that you look back on and, oh man, I shouldn't have bought this? <laughs> uh, yeah. I got me a charger. Um, I remember this 2007 charger and all the money I put into it was on the inside and in the trunk. And uh, basically I remember a couple of my teammates just looking at me like, mm. <laughs> because you know, I had a, a nice little trunk, had my name on it. You hit a button, things move out. You can see the speakers and all, but it was in the trunk. It wasn't like I'm just pulling up everywhere <laughs> and opening up the trunk and showing everybody what I can do. But, uh, yeah, I definitely spent a lot of money on that first paycheck with that. But uh, I hope these guys have, I know these guys have better people in their corner to help them make great decisions. And, uh, you know, you still are young, so enjoy that money. <laughs>